hey, hey. Armor MD here. Uh, so I am just on my way back home from a Maryland Grain Producers funding meeting. We have been meeting for the last three days, uh, reviewing grants. So just a quick shout out to uh, Peter, uh, FFA member, I believe he's from Queen Anne County. Uh, his FFA group uh, came in and did a presentation uh, looking for funds, a small uh, project they wanted to accomplish. Uh, so just a quick shout out to Peter with FFA. So we are under a winter storm warning in St. Mary's County. A forecast of three to six inches of snow coming in uh, after midnight tonight. So, as I said, I'm headed home. I'm uh, going to change clothes and head down to the farm and uh, put all of the snow plows on the tractors and get everything ready. We'll install the, uh, put the spreader in the back of the pickup truck, snow plow on that as well, fuel all the tractors up, get them plugged in. We've got a cold front coming in. Temperatures are going to get cold uh, into the 20s, I believe, overnight. So, looks like it's a pretty good chance that we're getting snow. And the odd thing about this storm is that it is a southern storm. It's coming up the coast uh, from the south. And St. Mary's County, I think at this point, is the only county in Maryland under the winter storm warning. Uh, it doesn't appear to the north of us, towards D.C., that they will get any snow or very little snow. Uh, so it appears St. Mary's County will be getting the brunt of this storm. That does not happen.
Saturday morning about 3.30. Looks like the snow started about an hour ago. Uh, very little accumulation. It's about 27 degrees. Uh, so every flake that is falling is sticking. Uh, as you can see, we have got the truck ready. Spreader is on. And the plow is on. So we are headed up to our county highway department to load up with salt. Uh, tractors are about to get moving. So uh, I guess we will be uh, plowing in about an hour the way it's uh, falling and coming down now. Forecast is four to six inches of snow. Uh, so as you can see here on the deck, it's, uh, it is accumulating. So we will uh, be out all day long. The wind is going to blow 15 to 25 miles an hour, I believe. And yeah, it's blowing, blowing now. So we will have some drifting problems. So I'm sure I will get some uh, video footage for you today. Stay tuned. Here we are waiting in line uh waiting to get loaded with salt there's the salt in the building over there you can see trucks ahead of me and if you look in the mirror you can see trucks behind me there are probably 40 trucks i'm guessing in line anywhere from dump trucks to half ton pickups three quarter ton pickups one ton pickups Dooleys, uh, just a little bit of everything. They have come out of the woodwork to make some money in this snow. Uh, there's pickup truck going by there. It's already been loaded. It looks like I am number four in line now to get loaded. Uh, it is snowing. It is quarter to five and 25 degrees. Uh, looks like about a half an inch of snow here.
Okay, so my ass is whooped. We started at 3.30 this morning, uh, and we are just now finishing up. Uh, for the most part, things went very well. We had 10 inches of snow. Uh, so my wife's car has not been cleaned off yet. Oh, well, maybe it has, because there's only two inches on there, but the official weather report uh, is 9.7 inches in ridge. As I was saying, for the most part, things went well. Uh, the truck did well, snowplow did well, but I did have a problem with the spreader. On my second load of salt, the motor on the spinner started acting up until it eventually quit on me. Uh, brand new spreader, second load of salt and it quit uh, so I'm not sure what the problem is I was gonna tear the motor apart uh, but then I figured it would void the warranty on it so I'm not gonna do that I'll just wait until Monday call the company and uh, have them ship a new one to me the tractors no problems there Jeffrey did lose a couple of pins on the plow on his tractor but uh, he had replacement pins so no issue there and our other guys with the salt spreaders, there were three tractors, four salt spreaders, trucks with salt spreaders and plows. We all worked together on the lower end of the county today. It worked out very well. Uh, very, very few issues all around. So overall, a, a good day, a long day. It is 18 degrees out here right now. 10 inches of snow. Uh, I don't even know if I have the energy for a glass of wine or a margarita tonight. I think I'm taking a shower and going right to bed. So we'll see what tomorrow brings. The wind is blowing a little bit. We did have some drifting issues today. Um, so we'll see if they call us out tomorrow to go clean up some areas. Uh, if they do, I hope it's not too early because I'm tired.
think I am off to do some sledding. We have a nice hill in front of our house, so uh, maybe I will get the sled out and uh, have a little bit of fun and lose a little bit of weight because, you know, we don't have any rope to pull us back to the top of the hill. We've got to walk back to the top of the hill. So, maybe that's what I'll do this afternoon. Okay, see ya!